Hello everyone, I am Pyro Falcon and this is Monster Rancher. In the last episode, Rudy learned a few new moves, so we're going to send him into the official B-Class tournament, which he didn't do very well the last time. In fact, he got injured, but hopefully he makes a better showing this time. He's got some slightly higher numbers and, again, some new moves to work with, which we will at least field test. Don't know how well he'll do, but we've at least got to give it a shot. Last time we fought Surin, we beat him at the last second with a chicken attack, but he's the only B-class monster we have fought and won against. So I don't I don't know how well we're gonna do against the whole field, but we can at least try. So that in fact the win was lucky. It wasn't very good. So hopefully we can make a better showing here. Yeah, Rudy's got a lot higher life than he used to. A little bit more speed, a little bit more skill, but he still doesn't have any defense. Should have probably put him on the defense course, too. We'll try that next time. Oh! Okay. Uh, stomp. That did not do that much... Well, I was going to say that didn't do that much damage, but he also has a shitload of defense, so... Yeah, this is the problem we had the last time we fought Surin. Uh, trying to field test the Super Stomp or whatever it's called. Yeah, that one. Uh, that, was pr that was pretty solid damage. Cost more guts than I would like it to, but that, that wasn't bad. And it's a coin flip's chance of working. So, not bad. Spam, 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 spam. Yes, chicken. That takes for goddamn ever to execute. Perfect. Yep, that, that one was just a waste of time. That's all I needed at the end there. Well, Suron, Suron probably is very upset that he has lost to us twice now. But now the real test happens. You know, for example, just beat the ever-loving piss out of us last time. I mean, we've got to take it one match at a time. I'm not feeling all that confident after that performance either, because he just... Rudy still doesn't have the accuracy we need. I should just... I, I need to either put him on that course or the defense course. And the accuracy course he's already mastered, that one would just be about the numbers. But he needs it, because he can't hit worth shit. All his moves are D percentage to hit, and that's not good for me. That is not how I like raising my monsters. I don't like having the RNG that big of a part of it. Not bad. That's a solid shot. It's just got a bit of a risk to it. A normal stomp isn't that bad. A normal stomp isn't that expensive. Trying to execute it. He's being kind of an asshole. There we go. He taunted me. He just said bring it. Ooh, nice. With a crit. Okay. Didn't mean to do a chicken. That's going to hurt if it doesn't lie in. Oh, okay, good. I was going to say, I, di I didn't mean to loot... Um, give up that many guts, willpower, whatever, in order to execute. But it worked. Worked out in our favor. Two down. Already doing better than we did the last time. Alright, Yuno's gonna be tricky. For her, we're gonna have to get lucky, because last time, every attack we had was sub-10% against her. But if we can just land our attacks, she's not going to be in a good place. We just need to land a couple. And she should not have landed as many as she did the last time either. The RNG very much worked against us the last time. So I'm hoping for slightly better luck this time. Okay, so... Oh, shit. I'm kind of surprised that landed. That was still only a 43% chance to hit. I absolutely do not want to use the chicken attack. Even if she fool arrays, because that is way too big of a risk. Alright, get in there. I 
If we land one of those stomps, she's gonna be upset. But it's got such a low chance to hit. The thing is whip to- ah, damn it, didn't mean to do that. Ah, it's so many guts. When you whiff on that, oh, that is precisely why I didn't want to do it that way. Come on, land it. Come on. Uh, it's... yeah. Damn. There's just nothing you can do when they're untouchable. I mean, there's... shit. It's alright. Yuno's probably always going to have our number. We have to get lucky against Yuno. And I should not have executed a chicken attack. I think the next time we face her, or any extremely high-speed monster, I need to get Rudy to maximum guts and then just go quantity over quality. Because if we had just landed any one of those stomps, I think I would have done enough damage to put her down. Not knock her out, but at least get her hurt enough that she would be below our health bars. Oh, man, Rudy, you are very RNG heavy, and I don't like that. I do not like RNG monsters. Ooh. It's not all that helpful either. Oh. Stomp does a significant amount of damage. Like, it does enough damage that I don't have to worry about the upgraded version, usually. The super stomp, uh, slime stomp. I mean, slime stomp does damage. Oh, shit! Ow. Oh. All right. <sighs> that chicken has saved us more times than I can count. That is not a sentence I thought I would say this morning. Or when I woke up this morning. Also, makes me a little hungry for chicken. I think we have some chicken cutlets in the freezer. We need to get some chicken in me before the end of today. <laughs> All right. Well, that was a long period of silence, wasn't it? I just didn't have anything to talk about. All right, let's get Stomp off of there. That way, if I accidentally use that move, it's not going to eat up 50 guts of mine. All right, let him, let him tire himself out there, Groody. As you do, all right. Stomp him. Nice. Yeah, that's definitely our go-to now. All that work on his hit points has definitely helped out, because we should not have survived some of these fights. We would not have survived some of these fights if uh, I was still on his old life points. Keep whipping him. It's alright. He can dodge those. That's That's not a big deal. Well, I guess go for the stomp now. That'll waste a bit more time, too. Oh, there we go. And it'll be a kill shot. Well done. So that move is definitely our go-to because it's slipping through enough and does enough damage that that's all we need. Ah, uh, crap. We have to fight Ryston here, too. So Ryston's gonna be the same. We're gonna have to probably just stick with the Stomp, because that way, if it slips through, it'll do enough damage to cause significant harm, and doing any other move will bring with it too much of a pain in the ass, whether that's too much, um, too, too inaccurate or not hard-hitting enough. Ugh, one thing at a time. Alright, doing fine, Rudy. Oh, that... That's not doing very much damage at all. Get him away from you. Come on. A lot of wasted time there, because I didn't execute my moves when... I needed to. Come on, just land one. Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. That does so much damage, especially it seems to have a high crit chance. 
So now Reno is really on the ropes, and he's not doing enough damage to me to challenge me. Even if he dodges those attacks, then he's got... You know, he, he doesn't have much left in him. Anything. Do anything. Yeah, so we just won, whether that lands or not, and which it did. So we get our knockout, but, like, it didn't matter. That's such a good move. That's that's the type of move I need. It wastes a lot of time. It doesn't... It hits very hard. And even though it's a little inaccurate, it's not so inaccurate that I'm constantly praying to RN Jesus that it slips through. It's cheap enough that we do enough of them that usually a couple are going to slip through. All right. Well, this is going to be the test for the strategy since Ryston has a high speed. Uh, 209. For us, 29% chance to hit. Very low. But it could be a lot lower. Wow. Let's say we were getting lucky there for a minute. All right, do it. Come on, Rudy. Land it, please. It's all right, but see, it's cheap enough that we've still got plenty more in the tank. We just have to hope that he doesn't keep landing those kinds of shots against us and we'll be all right. We're gonna have to start spamming. I usually find that I have to be more aggressive against terrors because they are excessively aggressive against us as well. No, no, no! Ah! All right, two losses. I don't know if that's defeat, but I assume it is. Uh, no, we are tied for first still against Ryston. All right. Wow. Tournaments don't usually... Usually one monster is either going to run the table or have no more than one loss. That's really surprising. All right. Let's give it another go. Ryston has 361 power. That's why he's doing so well. Yeah, like that's... And Guru Guru is slipping through because it's got just enough of a chance to succeed. I... Fuck me, man. Ryston's a really good monster. See, that's what I need. I need those to slip through the stomps. Because they will do the damage. Yes! There we go. Well done, Rudy. I still feel like I prayed to RN Jesus more than I am comfortable with usually in those fights. Oh, man. Well, we've got some cash. He's now in the A-Class. I cannot imagine he'd be able to fight in any of the A-Class fights. Not yet. He's going to have to get something to 500 before he's ready. So if Rudy can't... We've got to get his speed up. Or his, or his defense. Let's get defense up. Or at least until he masters whatever technique is on that course. It doesn't have to get as high up as his speed. But if we can get his defense up to, say, 200, then he'll be better off. Let's see what his stupid... Oh, no, we've seen that animation. All right. Um, go ahead and rest. And... Because that was a significant change with one of the monsters. I, I can't remember which monster it was, but just raising defense 100 points was pretty significant for my success rate. So, let's work with defense. It's not what I would prefer. If I can get it to even 200, I think I'll be in good shape. Is he going to ride the motorcycle in the dust storm? No, he's going to do something far more ridiculous. Why did I think it wouldn't be ridiculous? Oh, God, that's such a low number. It's going to take him all year just to get defense up to 200 at that rate. So he can't do defense worth a shit. That's the lesson I'm learning from this.
Ugh. So he he gets by on having high life and or high speed, which is fine. I, I don't mind working on his speed either. But I, I still kind of want to keep doing that until I get a technique out of it. Since we don't know what kind of technique we're looking at. I guess I'll work on his speed when I'm not on the training course, but I'll work on his defense when I am on the training course, at least until I get that technique. I feel like I'm wasting my time whenever I'm working on numbers that are not what they are predisposed to. Because while I'm only gaining a few points here on defense, I could instead be spending that time getting his accuracy or power up, which would be more of a gain, but... Need a little bit of defense, man. He can't keep taking those shots. I also love how, like, after just seeing that once or twice, now I'm just completely numb to it. Sure, it's a doodle that's cartwheeling across the desert. Why not? It's just a typical day here at Monster Rancher. Rudy found Sting Dust. Great, we can sell that and go on a tra another training course. Come on, man, you gotta learn that technique. That's the only reason we've still got you doing that. What? Sale? No, that's the item shop. Although, wouldn't it be nice if for sales that means they would pay you a little something extra too? <laughs> All right, dude, yeah, God. The, I like Monster Rancher, but man, there's a lot, oh, well. Yeah, no. Maybe. No, never mind. I won't sell it. I'll be good for the next monster. <laughs> um. Shoot, lost my train of thought. Oh! Th as much as I like the Monster Rancher games, there are parts of it that are very, um, annoying. Like, all the blathering that you have to go through in order to do particular things. Um. It's not bad. Kind of reminds me of Death Stranding, how there are a ton of animations and cutscenes for just little things, and it's like, just hurry up, get to the point, let me, let me play. And the later Monster Ranchers did that a lot better. They managed to kind of hurry things along a little bit. Evo was really good about it, in my opinion. Man, I need to play Evo again. I need to, I need to get it on the emulator, since my PlayStation 2 is being an asshole. No, Karn! No, I didn't mean- No, no, I, I had two chances to say no and I accidentally said yes! Ah, damn it. It's because I'm getting- This is what happens when I get annoyed. I start- Okay, that's... Alright. Anyway, this is what happens when I get annoyed. Ah, uh, the fog of war is still there. Oh, wait. Yeah, the Fog of War is still there. Oh, that's unfortunate. I was hoping that the Fog of War would go away when they... on a return trip. But I'm gonna do the same thing I did with the last one and just go north? Northeast, I guess. Until I find something interesting. Hey, there's something interesting. Uh, I probably shouldn't have skipped that. I don't know what he said. I mean, I know he's giving lore. Oh, god damn it! Rudy! <sighs> Rudy. Rudy. I mean, great that we got to see... Holly being all cute with her little floofy hat, but... Come on, man. <sighs> Rudy, you suck. You just... you suck so hard. We're not doing the official tournament, are you out of your friggin' mind? Don't yell at me about him passing out. It wasn't me who got him lost in the first place, Holly. This is your fault. This is everyone's fault but mine. That's going to do it for today's episode. I guess in the next one we'll just keep working on his numbers. There's nothing more we can do. 
Can't send him on the training course, we don't have the money, so we'll just have to keep working him at home and hope that we get those numbers up to something respectable. Thank you all very much for watching. I will see you again tomorrow for another episode.